Well, hello and welcome back to my channel. It's Salisa coming to you from Beautifully Me and you, de Bellamente y tú y yo. And you guys, today I have some cash here out of my paycheck and I thought I'd put some towards the Easy Debt Snowball Tracker. Ooh, that's a mouthful. As well as put some towards my Bills Binder and we'll kick off Vlogmas just like that. So if that sounds like something that interests you, then let's get right into it. All right, so first and foremost, um, there's gonna be a few things going on for Vlogmas, and that's why I wanted to do a really short cash stuffing to kind of take care of the housekeeping rules for the next 12 days. Yep, we're gonna have a video every day between December 12th and December 24th, and every day we will have a giveaway. So today I decided to do a giveaway of two products from my shop, um, and it's everything excluding the Skipper Double Scratch Off book, okay? But anything else that's in my shop, you'll be able to pick two products, and that's what we'll be giving away for today. Most days we're gonna have cash giveaways, so I can just immediately get the cash right out to you or the form of a gift card or cash app as soon as the giveaway is announced. But for today, to start it off, I decided I would do two products for my shop. The other thing we need to talk about <laughs> that is super exciting for me is the 12 Days of Christmas song. I set up a specific email that will be used only for your video submissions if you wanna be a part of the 12 Days of Christmas song that I'm gonna be putting together. We're gonna carol as a group, y'all, okay? <laughs> I don't know if I'm going to have a singing part in it, but every day I'll sing the part that needs to be submitted. Only thing I ask is you record it in something clear, like in front of a window or something, so the video will be clear for everyone to see your face. And you only have to do probably from the shoulder or neck up, unless you want to do your whole body. You get creative and do what you want to do. You guys can put add decorations if you want, you know, reindeer ears, a Rudolph nose, however you want to do it. <laughs> But yeah, what I want you to do is submit your video footage to beautifulme0515 at gmail. And I'm going to list it down in the description, but it's also here on the screen, beautifulme0515 at gmail.com. That is going to be specifically for the 12 day submission. So every day I'm going to sing the little part that we need to sing. And in the subject line, if you could put what day it is so I can piece them together, then that'll be good. I need about 12 people to sing day one. And day one goes like this. On the first day of Christmas, my true love gave to me a partridge in a pear tree. Now, you do it in your own key, however you want, but that's the little clip that I need you guys to email to me if you wanna be a part of this whole video collaborate that, is it collaborate? No, that's not a right word. That's not even a word. The video collab that I'm gonna to put together, I'll be splicing up everybody's videos and making it into one long one that will reveal on the final day. The next thing we need to discuss is we need to celebrate 30,000 subscribers. And so in order to do that, I wanna host a live and that's gonna be on December the 19th, which is a Monday, and I'm gonna do it at 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. So I know that's kind of late, but that will catch some people from the Pacific Coast as well. Okay, so we're going to do a live giveaway on December 19th at 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. I'll put it here on the screen and hopefully you guys can be there for the 30k giveaway. Okay, and that will be the video for that day. All right, so let's see. Did we talk about it all? We're going to do some cash stuffing today. We're gonna have some people submit some video submissions to the email. If you lose the email, again, it'll be down in the description. Also, today's giveaway, we're gonna have a secret word embedded within the video that you'll need to comment. And that secret hashtag, it's gonna be a hashtag. And that secret hashtag is what I'll use in order to pull the winner of two of my Etsy products, everything except the Scratch and Save Skipper Double Book. And yeah, let's get it started, y'all. Okay. <laughs> Okay, so first things first, I do want to stuff my bills binder before I work on this tracker. You guys, all my little bulbs from last year, they're not on a string, so they're just like literally sitting there. We're going to hope they make it all 12 days. <laughs> right now, we're going to work on this binder, um, and this is my bills binder. I definitely want to flip towards the back and work on Comcast as well as Stream to catch them up because I think everything else, let me check water. Water, if you haven't been here before, these envelopes are for my bills. I'm trying to get at least three months ahead. This dollar amount is the amount of one month, so water should have 300 or 200 if it's two months ahead. 50, 70, 90, 130, no wait, 110, 130, 40, 150. Yeah, this one's short as well. Okay, so that's 150. 
And wait, was I two months ahead or was I one and a half months ahead? Let me let me check one more. I'm sorry, y'all. Hold on. Line of credit is supposed to be 130. It has 51, 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 195. Okay, so I think they're all one and a half months ahead, every single um, category except for the last two. And I want to use some money to get those ahead right now. So let's see. Stream. If it's one and a half, 20, 40, 60, 70, 80. Okay, so let's just put 115. First of all, look, y'all, I didn't got so going with 12 days of Christmas. I forgot to count the money. So I took some money out of the account, and this isn't all of my paycheck. Um, I will be coming back to do some cash stuffing with some other money. But for right now, I have 1, 2, 53, 54, 55, 20, 40, 60, 86, 6, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 85, 90, 95, 7. All right, so that's $700. Let me set that up in the cash tray. And so if we need another um, portion to make one and a half for stream, half of stream would be about, what is that? 60, let's just say. 20, 40, 60. So we need 105 to make another um, full payment. So I'll just do a hundred and a five dollar bill. So let's see what that is. 120, 40, 60, 65, 70, 75, 175. Yeah, that's right. That's the 115 plus an extra 60 for the other half, okay? So that's 175 for stream. And then Comcast, I know was short as well. 175, half of that, y'all. This math is too much. Hold on, hold on, <laughs> hold on. Okay, 175 divided by two, 87. So let's just say 90. So it should have 175 plus 90. And that'll be $265 is what I'm shooting for. And right now I have 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 91, 110, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 75. 175. So I need another $90 to go in here. And that should be 265. Why does she pick up a 50? 50, 70, 90, 110, 130, 150, 60, 70, 80, 92, 210, 20, 30, 40, 50, 65, 265. All right, so now everything in the bills binder is definitely caught up to one and a half times its amount, okay? So I got another one and a half to save and I'm gonna bring back some more money to do another cash stuffing with that later. But when I went to the bank, I got pretty much the money for the debt, easy debt snowball tracker from my paycheck, which was a $700. But I'm like, while I'm here, let me catch this up. I don't have enough to make it to the next category on the um, debt tracker anyway. So let's go ahead and talk about that. All right, so I did already save the money for the home furniture, um, for the office furniture rather. And I started looking around and honestly, $700, I don't know if it's gonna be enough, but um, because when I look on Facebook Marketplace, it's like I got to drive really far in order to pick up stuff. And my little car, I have a little hybrid. It's not big enough to pick up the furniture. So I'd have to have my boyfriend go kind of out of the way in order to get it. And I'm thinking, is it worth it or should I just go ahead and buy new? I don't know. So I'm still debating on that, but I have the money still here. Um, for today, I'm going to put whatever's left over into the washer and dryer fund. And um, you guys, I also went looking at refrigerators. Oh my gosh, the refrigerator that I want, the refrigerator that I want with um, a three-year warranty and taxes is gonna be like $2,000. So low key, I gotta get another 500 from somewhere before I can buy, cause I have like 1400 and something dollars from the penny challenge done twice. I could take another 500 out of like my 2022 challenges or I could take it out of my scratch and save challenge. But for right now, um, until I get to that 500, I'm gonna try to hold off and get there by the end of the month is my goal. So just know I'll be talking about getting extra money for the refrigerator and that's why. I ended up settling on um, a Samsung and it's a French door. It does not have any like water or ice dispenser on the door because I just don't like that kind. But um, I decided to go ahead and go with the French doors because I like the way it looked and it's stainless steel and it's $15.99 at Best Buy. And then plus taxes and the warranty is gonna be like $2,000. So yeah, I gotta get another 500 up on that. All right, for right now, we're gonna work on the washer and dryer. And this is 152, 53, 50, oh no. Let's try again. 152, 53, 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 94, 450, 60, 70, 80, 90, 95, 5, and 505. 
You know, I think I'm going to take this tin out. Look at this tin, you guys. It's so old. I want to put this in my daughter's graduation binder. So I'm going to set that to the side and we'll do that in just a minute. So that means I should have $4.95. $1, $52, $50, $20. Oh, wait. 1, 52, 53, 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 94, 50, 60, 70, 80, 85, 90, 95. Yeah, 495. All right, so I'm going to make a line item that says 495 for the month of December so far. There will be more to um, contribute to this, but I'm going to put 495 for right now. And hold on, let me get the Sharpie. Visa V's is not the move. Let me get the Sharpie. All right, so we're gonna say today's date is 12-12, and we're gonna do, there's no minimum payment, but we're paying 495. So the ending balance then will be um, 1,005. And I really need to increase that as well, because while I was looking for refrigerators, I was looking at washer and dryers, and they're like this amount without taxes, y'all. That's the problem. I am gravely underestimating what things are costing. I think my my son's bed, I overestimated, but like this one is underestimated. The refrigerator is definitely underestimated because um, there's very little refrigerators with warranty and taxes I can walk out the door with for $1,500. That's the one I'm settling on is like 17 cubic feet. And the one I'm settling on or purchasing and loving is 28 cubic feet. So you see the difference. Okay. <laughs> All right, so I'm going to set this $10 to the side because I want to put that in my daughter's graduation binder just because it's so cute. And we're going to go to home renovations. Now, I did take a little bit out of here. I think I took $100 out of here because I wanted to um, get these supplies that I needed for the office space. So I did go ahead and do that. Um, but everything else should be in here. So I have still that $1,000, $2,000 in the bank. And I'm debating if I want to take that money out of the bank and add it to this envelope so I'll have money to shop with. But it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight, fifty, nine, nine, fifty, one thousand, twenty, forty, sixty, seventy, eighty, ninety, eleven hundred, fifty, sixty, seventy, eighty, eighty five, ninety, ninety five, eleven hundred and ninety five dollars, which is good. That's the seven hundred for the refrigerator and then some to go towards the washer and dryer. I mean, that's seven hundred dollars for the office space as well as some to go towards the washer and dryer. So that's right. I had an extra hundred in there and that's why I took that hundred out and went ahead and spent it on some office supplies that I needed. Um, but it didn't count towards the money that I've stuffed in there, you know, cause like this is seven plus that is 1195. That's exactly what I have in there right now. Okay. For the $10, I want to go ahead and put that into December's folder. Even though I don't have anything in there, this is my daughter's graduation binder. You guys, I looked everywhere for these binders. So maybe Tina sold out because they're just not easy to find right now. <laughs> okay. So I was like, if I could find them, I'm going to buy them and I'm going to sell them. But yeah, no, I couldn't find them. So I don't know that I'll be able to stock these. Um, but for my daughter, I do want to put some money in the month of December. And I'm only going to put this $10 bill because it's an old $10 bill. But we will be putting more money in this this month. I did get the stickers from Hobby Lobby. The binder I got from um, a pink cloth life. Tina at a pink cloth life. I bought it directly from her. But um, yeah, I was going to sell them if I could find it, but I cannot find it. It's like I found it, but they're not in production or something. So yeah, that's a negative. But um, I did go ahead and put that $10 towards my daughter's binder. So she'll have an old bill in there. I wonder if she's even going to, she probably won't even recognize it. Like how old do you have to be to recognize that type of $10 bill? She'll probably think of a fake money or something, you know? <laughs> All right, you guys, I think we have done everything. I tried to keep this first video pretty short and sweet, um, but yeah, at this point, we are all done. I went ahead and put the money in the Easy Debt Snowball Tracker. If you guys are interested in one of these trackers to like track some savings that you wanna do or to track your debts, I'll put a video up here that explains how you use it for debt tracking purposes and you can find it listed down below in my Etsy storefront. Um, you can either purchase a digital download or you can buy a laminated copy like this to have a physical product sent to you. Um, those are available in my Etsy store. And yeah, I'm just plugging away trying to get to all the renovations that I want to do for the house for 2023. And I'm starting now. Why not, right? Okay, so if you made it all the way to the end of this video, I want to try to find some Christmas emojis for every single video. Let's go ahead and put this one single emoji right here if you made it, and that'll let me know that you're a real one. You made it all the way to the end of the video. Don't forget, comment the secret hashtag that was embedded in the video as well, so you'll have a chance to win two products from my Etsy store, some products 
will be excluded, which is just going to be the Scratch and Save Skipper Double um, book. I'm not going to have that one, but any other two products you can pick from my shop and have those sent to you. Also, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you'll be notified the next time I put out a video. That'll be day two of Vlogmas tomorrow. So yeah, go ahead and come back so you can um, be involved in the giveaways that'll be going on. And also you might be the winner, okay? If you win the product, you do have to reach out to me either via email or Instagram in order for you to get what it is you have um, won. So just be mindful of that as well. Hit the like button so this video can be suggested to other people who might need it. And then what's the last thing? Share the video. Yeah, if you know someone who needs help being encouraged, saving, or maybe even just wants to win a giveaway this Christmas, then share this video with others so they'll be notified as well. All right, you guys, lots of fun content to come for the next 12 days. I thought we'd slide into it kind of easily, and I'm super excited to get you guys' video submissions. So I will talk to you tomorrow. Take care.